Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Sunday the 30th of April 2023. I almost forgot. Last day of April. Uh, May Day tomorrow. And we're just a few hours away now from um, International Jazz Concert, which I always listen to uh, every year. Although I don't, it's not normally particularly good jazz, I must say. But anything that encourages people to listen to jazz. I, I see there's an interview coming up in a couple of hours as well with Bill Clinton and Herbie, Herbie Hancock talking to Bill Clinton. Not Bill Clinton, not one of my favorite politicians, I must say. But <laughs> uh, at least he did play the saxophone. And at least he was interested in jazz, whatever other... Um, um, I was going to say vices he had, but that would be, I didn't mean it like that, actually. That wasn't what I was thinking. Uh, anyway, uh, good luck to them. And, uh, a couple of weeks ago, Australia lost uh, its one of its national treasures in Barry Humphreys, but they have one left, and that's Tim Minchin. And I see that he's interviewed in yesterday's um, Guardian. Um, it's still online now. Um, and... Uh, I mean, he's an incredible talent, um, really just m amazing talent, Tim Minchin, song comedian and songwriter, of course. Check out his stuff all over the internet. <laughs> uh, but the uh, reason I brought this up is because he was interviewed and he was saying uh, that he thinks some radical and progressive politics is very shallow uh, because of the way that they will just take things out of context. And I have to agree. Uh, I've seen this for uh, over quite some time now whereas uh, you know um they will take a word out of context and say well you know you use this particular word um but it without the context where it was used you can't really understand what the meaning was and this is certainly a bad thing and i've seen it a lot in progressive politics and uh, something to be avoided Come on, let's have the full story. Right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? We've got the LA Times uh, expert level game. I often forget what these things are called. Uh, and I can see a couple of things already. I can see sevens and nines. More than one seven, actually, I think. So uh, let's get on with the sevens since I see a couple of those already. So we've got sevens blocking across here and up here. And that's going to put the seven there. And I can also see the sevens blocking down here and up here. And that one across there that's going to give me a seven. Like so. We've got seven blocking down here. And across here is going to put the seven there. And that's probably as far as we can take it. Because I think we've got sevens left in those squares. Now I saw a nine as well. Nine blocking up here. Nine down here. And a nine across here. So... That jumped up at me while I was chatting to you. Now we've also got ones blocking up here, and that's going to give us a one in that square there. We have three down here and three, oops, three up here. Can't keep my finger on the keyboard today. And I have I've had no alcohol, so it's not that. Uh, shall we go through the digits to see what's where? Yes, let's. I'll just pencil in a few squares, not with a pencil, of course. Just by clicking and highlighting. You know what I mean. Just it helps me see the pattern. Sometimes we have two blocking across here and across here. So we shall place our two there. We have two blocking down here. That's going to put the two there. Missing numbers up here before we go any further are four and eight. Um, so when we see the five blocking across here, we know five is going to fit here. And we know this is going to be a two. Uh, sh what's missing here? This is four and eight. 8, so 4 and 8 go here, oh, it's 4 and 8, how about that, 4, 8, 4, 8, 4, 8, how about that, nice little pairs, so this is not 4 or 8, and so when we see the 6 blocking across here, we know that the 6 has to go there, and the other number, which is not 4 or 8, is a 5, 
don't like these fast starts. They often lead to difficult endings. <laughs> um, I see five and nine blocking across here and five and nine blocking across here. So we shall have a pair of five and nine here. Um, now three blocks this square and three blocks this square. So that has to be a three. We know we've got five and nine here. So in these squares, we'll be looking for the four and eight as we have here, four and eight. I also know that this square here cannot be four or eight. Uh, I wonder if we have a single possibility. It could be one. It's not two, three, it's not four, it's not five, it's not six, it's not seven, it's not eight, it's not nine, it's a four. Uh, sorry, it's a, it's a one. <laughs> sorry, it's not four or eight, is it? it's a one. So we'll get that in very quickly. Okay, now we've got ones blocking across here like this. And the reason, oh, if anybody, if we have any newcomers to Sudoku, the reason it's not four or eight is because we have a unique rectangle here, four, eight, four, eight, four, eight. It means this square here cannot be a four, eight. Otherwise, the game would be invalid. Uh, just as a quick explanation for newcomers to Sudoku. Since we do often get questions about that uh, unique rectangle, I think. Um, right, what's left to go here? We've got four blocking across here. That's going to put four into that square. Four blocks across here. Here's our four. Here's our eight. Uh, missing numbers up here. Six and eight. Missing numbers. Oh, six and eight go here. So we can definitely get that, which will be a three. Now, missing numbers here are seven, eight. We have the 8 blocking up here. The 8 will go here. Here's the 7. Missing numbers here are 9 and something. Something being a 5. Okay. I'm getting a bad vibe. I just This has just been too easy so far. I'm, I'm getting bad vibes about it. It means it's going to have an impossible ending or something. 7's <laughs> in this square. Ah, 7's finished. That was the last 7. We have three blocking up here and up here and across here. There's our three. We cannot finish the threes because they will be left in those squares there. Okay, we have five blocking down here and down here. That puts the five into that square. Now we have two blocking down here and across here. That's going to give me a two in that square. two across here like this gives me and a two down here puts a two there uh, missing numbers here and here are four and six I believe six blocks down here so there's a six there's a four Three, five, and six all block this square. Three, five, and six will be here. That has to be nine. Nine blocks up here. That gives us a nine in that square. The missing digit here is a five. Three and six are in the same column, so that has to be a five. And then we can take the fives up here, up here, and across here, and across here like this. There's a five. 
Missing numbers in this column are 8 and 9. We've got the 9 blocking across here. So here's the 9 and here's the 8. 8 blocks this way. Here's the 8. And I think it was a 4, wasn't it? We needed 8 and 4 in those in all of these squares, didn't we? Uh, so that's got to be 8, 4. No, don't know. Um, completed digits are 5 and 7. We have 9 blocking across here and down here, so 9 fits into that square. We just need one more up here, so sure we can get that okay five seven nine are finished two blocks up here two blocks up here and two blocks across here so there is our two two across here two across here and two up there gives us a two in that square one up here, one across here, here's a one. Doesn't look like we're going to have any logic puzzles at this stage, does it? This could have been the easiest um, Los Angeles Times Expo. If I've clicked on the right game, that is. I hope I haven't clicked on a, the wrong game by mistake. But if it is the correct game, this could have been one of the easiest ones we've ever seen, actually. Six blocking down here, here's the six. Missing number here is a three. Three blocks across here, here's the three last number up here is a four four across here four up here there's our four four blocking down here here's our four four blocking across here here's our four this is an eight we need eight for that square there we need eight up here eight there missing digit here is going to be a six six blocks up here that gives us a six in that square and a one will finish the game oh dear mm. We want them some we want them doable but not quite that easy I think. Okay. Uh thanks and uh hope to see you again for another Sudoku another time. Bye bye. Take care.